Welcome to Folio Tech, the website for your University of Georgia Teacher Education Program electronic portfolio. This website is designed to provide you with an ePortfolio that collects artifacts to address the Georgia Framework for Teaching domains. Once uploaded, your instructors will be able to evaluate your work versus these standards. You will navigate your portfolio using the left assessment menu. To upload an example of your work, first click on a section. Many times sections are grouped under a common heading. To access these sections, simply click the bolded text and then a specific section. Now read these section instructions and then click on the name of the standard that will be addressed with the work you are going to upload. To upload your work here, simply click Add File. Here you have five options. Upload a new file, add an existing file from the file storage area on Foliotech, add a presentation portfolio, link to an external file or website, or upload a new zipped website. Make your selection and click Next. Select the file to upload from your computer using the Add Files link. Find the file on your computer and rename it if you wish. Once you've added all the files to this area, click OK. If you would like to see a description of the standard being addressed with this assignment, click the Standards tab. You can view the standard description by clicking the View Description link. Once your artifact for this domain has been uploaded, please complete the rationale journal located in the same area. To complete the journal, simply click on the name and then click Add Entry. Give your entry a name. Type the rationale and then click OK. Now close this window to return to your portfolio. You will follow this process for any additional artifacts or rationale journals required in your portfolio. Your ePortfolio also allows you to receive formative feedback from faculty members and other students in your program while you're working on building your portfolio. This is simply intended to help you along in the portfolio construction process. No scoring takes place here. To request review from faculty, use the Request Review button and choose the appropriate faculty member. To request review from peers, click the Sharing tab and search for the student with whom you wish to share. Once a comment has been left on your portfolio, you will be notified through the to-do list on your home page, and you can click the Comments tab within each element to view the feedback. Within each transition in the left menu, you will find sections that contain forms that have been required by your program. Many of these forms are completed by faculty members and have been made available to you for viewing. To review the results of a form completed about you, Click on the section that contains the form, click on the form container, and finally click on the form file to open the form. Review the answers as completed by your faculty member, and then close this form to return to your portfolio. Other forms in these areas must be completed by you, the student. To access the form, you will follow the same process. Click on a section, click on the form container, and finally the form file. Now you will be required to complete the answers within the form, and then click Save and Close at the bottom. Once again, close this area to return to your portfolio. You can view a summary of your portfolio at any time by clicking on the By Topic or By Standard Views located in the left assessment menu. You may also view the status of evaluations by clicking on the Evaluations link. Evaluations in the current tab have been sent to an instructor for scoring but are not yet complete. 
Evaluations in the Completed tab will show you how you scored versus the Georgia Framework for Teachers domains. To view your scores, click on the name of the evaluation. View specific information about your score by clicking on each unit of the evaluation. Your account also comes equipped with an area for creating a personal showcase portfolio. This portfolio builder is located under the Presentation tab. Here, you can create portfolios that can be shared with others via email or a web link. Many students find this useful for job searches as they near the end of their program. Watch the tutorial video here to learn more about building presentation portfolios. If you need help with your account at any time, always check out our context-specific help menu located in the top right corner of your screen. This menu will provide you with step-by-step -step instructions for every function in your FolioTech account. If you need additional assistance, you may contact our support line at 888-365-4639, option 2 for technical assistance. Our support line is available Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 Central Time. This concludes the video for the University of Georgia students.